Canada has beat Honduras before, a couple of weeks ago in Honduras, where they play in very hot, very dry conditions. It's a lot different at the field in St. John's, where Saturday's game will be played. But when the Canadians arrived here today, the rain and the cold were exactly what they wanted to see. Welcome to Newfoundland. That's it. The weather is suiting us fine. Because the Hondurans won't be used to this, will they? It's these kinds of conditions the Hondurans are up against, and insiders say that's one of the main reasons the Canadian Soccer Association wanted the game here. After all, of almost any place in Canada, this place is likely to be the coldest and the wettest come Saturday. If it works against them, uh, then we won't be too unhappy about that. But uh, uh, I really think that soccer teams have got to take into consideration all conditions and get on with the job. Geography may be another factor. St. John's is further away from Honduras than any other Canadian city. It took the Hondurans two days to get here, so they are suffering jet lag. But they were still pretty confident last night. But we've been working out uh, in, in a camp where we had in, in Honduras, uh, which is relatively cool up in the mountains, and that, that more or less is more or less what we're going to find around here. Today, though, it was a different story, 11 degrees outside, so the players decided to practice indoors. We don't, <laughs> we are afraid because of the weather. We have, we feel really cold and nobody go, nobody, nobody wants to go out. The forecast does call for sunshine Saturday, but whatever the weather, it's going to be an exciting match and if they win or tie, an exciting day for the Canadians. Catherine Wright, CBC News, St. John's.